Hello everyone, welcome to today's video. In last video, I had discussed how to calculate purchase consideration by using lump sum method. In today's class, let us see one more problem. Let us see the question. Question is on the screen. Please take the screenshot of the question. Balance sheet of Anand Limited shows the following details as on 31st March 2023. Now, see here, they have given the balance sheet of Anand Limited Company. It shows first one 1 lakh equity shares of rupees 10 fully paid rupees 10 lakh means Anand Limited Company has 1 lakh equity shares of rupees 10 each which amounted to rupees 10 lakh. Anand Limited Company on the balance sheet got to the in health either and Anand Limited Company only 1 lakh equity shareholders are each share in a value 10 rupees. Allega yeshtagate amount to 10 lakhs. Second, they are telling that 50,000 5% preference shares of rupees 10 each fully paid at rupees 5 lakh. They are telling that Anand Limited Company has 50,000 preference shares and each preference shares costs rupees 10 each. Anand Limited Company has 50,000 preference shareholders. Each preference share in a value 10 rupees. Banureka Limited acquired Anand Limited on the above mentioned date and the Banu Reka Limited Company agreed to pay the followings. Now, Banu Reka Limited. There is a company called as Banu Reka Limited. It acquired. Banu Reka Limited acquired. Which company does Banu Reka Limited acquired? Banu Reka Limited acquired Anand Limited. So, Anand Limited is selling company banureka limited is purchase company banureka limited do anand limited na acquire martta ide hagagi anand limited selling company agutte banureka limited purchase company agutte in the balance sheet of anand limited anand limited na balance sheet alli yen yen helta idare first point has 1 lakh equity shareholders 1 lakh equity shareholders ide each share is rupees 10 so total amount is 10 lakh second thing it has 50000 5% preference share so 5% preference shares the 50000 rest of each preference share value is 10 rupees which means 5 lakh this equity shareholders and this preference shareholders are of anand limited company now, Anand Limited Company is selling its company to Banu Reka Limited Company. So, what happens before Banu Reka Limited Company acquires Anand Limited Company? First, it has to settle these shareholders. Iga 1 lakh equity shareholders, 50,000 different shareholders. Anand Company gel ola patirtare. Banu Reka Company is purchasing Anand Limited Company. So, you ribruge first of Banu Reka Limited Company duddu galna kotpudbeko. Now, I told you that Banu Reka Limited will have to pay to the equity shareholders and preference shareholders of Anand Limited because it is purchasing Anand Limited. Now, they are given in the question in what ways does Banu Reka Limited pays this 10 lakhs as well as this 5 lakh. Now, let us see the question. First, they have told that, see this thing, Banureka limited has, limit has to pay, right? First, how it will pay? They have told in the question, see the question. 50,000 equity shares of rupees 10 each at a premium of 12 each. Means, first they are issuing 50,000 equity shares of rupees 12 each, which means 6 lakh. So, out of 10 lakh, they are giving 6 lakh to the issue of 50,000 equity shares. Next, second what they are issuing? They are issuing 30,000 8% preference shares. They are issuing 30,000 8% preference share of rupees 10 each. So, they are told that 30,000 preference shares of at rupees 10. This is 10 which is nothing but 3 lakh. 7% debentures, they are issuing debentures which is amounted to rupees 2 lakh. So, what they have told in the question means this equity shareholders will be paid these three things. So, equity shareholders of Anand Limited will be paid 
ದೀಸ್ ಮೆನಿ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಬಾನು ರೇಖಾ ಲಿಮಿಟೆಡ್ ಆನನ್ ಲಿಮಿಟೆಡ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಇರತಕ್ಕಂತಹ ಈಕ್ವಿಟಿ ಶೇರ್ ಹೋಲ್ಡರ್ಸ್ಗೆ ಈ ರೀತಿ ಅವರು ಪೇಮೆಂಟ್ ಅನ್ನ ಮಾಡ್ತಾ ಇದಾರೆ ಯಾರು ಬಾನು ರೇಖಾ ಲಿಮಿಟೆಡ್ ನಾವು ಫಾರ್ ಪ್ರಿಫರೆಂಟ್ ಈಕ್ವಿಟಿ ಶೇರ್ ಹೋಲ್ಡರ್ಸ್ ಪೇಮೆಂಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಓವರ್ ನಾವು ವಾಟ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಪ್ರಿಫರೆಂಟ್ ಶೇರ್ ಹೋಲ್ಡರ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಗಿವಿಂಗ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಗಿವಿಂಗ್ ತರ್ಟಿ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಈಕ್ವಿಟಿ ಶೇರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ರುಪೀಸ್ ಟೆನ್ ಈಚ್ ಇಶ್ಯೂಡ್ ಎಟ್ ಅ ಪ್ರೀಮಿಯಂ ಆಫ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ವ್ ತರ್ಟಿ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಈಕ್ವಿಟಿ ಶೇರ್ಸ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಹ್ಯಾವಿಂಗ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಇಶ್ಯೂಯಿಂಗ್ ಎಟ್ ಅ ಪ್ರೀಮಿಯಂ ಆಫ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ ವಿಚ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ತ್ರೀ ಲ್ಯಾಕ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ಟಿ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ವಾಟ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಟೆಲ್ಲಿಂಗ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಇಶ್ಯೂಯಿಂಗ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಪ್ರಿಫರೆನ್ಸ್ ಶೇರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ರುಪೀಸ್ ಟೆನ್ ಈಚ್ ವಿಚ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಟೂ ಲ್ಯಾಕ್ ಫಾರ್ ಫೈವ್ ಪರ್ಸೆಂಟ್ ಪ್ರಿಫರೆನ್ಸ್ ಶೇರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಆನಂದ್ ಲಿಮಿಟೆಡ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಪೇಯಿಂಗ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಪ್ರಿಫರೆನ್ಸ್ ಶೇರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ರುಪೀಸ್ ಟೆನ್ ಈಚ್ ಆಫ್ ಬಾನು ರೇಖಾ ಲಿಮಿಟೆಡ್ ಸೊ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಕ್ವೆಶನ್ ವಾಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ ದೇವ್ ಗಿವನ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ದೇವ್ ಗಿವನ್ ಹೌ ಮೆನಿ ಶೇರ್ಸ್ ದಸ್ ಆನಂದ್ ಲಿಮಿಟೆಡ್ ಕಂಪನಿ ಇಸ್ ಹ್ಯಾವಿಂಗ್ ದೆನ್ ದೇವ್ ಗಿವನ್ ಮೋಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಡಿಸ್ಚಾರ್ಜ್ ದೇವ್ ಗಿವನ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ವಾಟ್ ಮೋಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಡಿಸ್ಚಾರ್ಜ್ ವೆನ್ ಮೋಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಡಿಸ್ಚಾರ್ಜ್ ಇಸ್ ಗಿವನ್ ಆಸ್ ಐ ಹವ್ ಟೋಲ್ಡ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ವೀಡಿಯೋ ವಿ ನೀಡ್ ಟು ಫಾಲೋ ವಿಚ್ ಮೆಥಡ್ ವೆನ್ ಮೋಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಡಿಸ್ಚಾರ್ಜ್ ಇಸ್ ಗಿವನ್ we need to follow net payment method so now let us see how to calculate purchase consideration by using net payment method for this problem now this is the format to calculate purchase consideration by using net payment method now first what they are doing in the question you can see question a they are paying it to equity shareholders so first you have to show all the payments made to equity shareholders of anand limited anand limited al irontha equity shareholders ke banu reka limited en en kodta ide annodanna first na avile torusbeko first we have to show what are the things or in which mode does banu reka limited is paying to the equity shareholders of anand limited first there issuing equity shares they are issuing equity shares that is 50000 equity shares of rupees 10 but issued at a premium of 12 rupees which is nothing but 6 lakh in working note also i have showed this second thing what they are giving they are giving 8% preference shares how many preference shares this 30000 preference shares of rupees 10 each which is nothing but 3 lakh next they are giving 7% debentures and the value is 2 lakh payment to the equity shareholders of anand limited is over now next payment is made to preference shareholders of anand limited payments to preference shareholders of anand limited anand limited company equity shareholders ke enen kodta idivi anta bardidagide ಈಗ ಆನಂದ್ ಲಿಮಿಟೆಡ್ ಕಂಪನಿಯಲ್ಲಿ ಇರ್ತಕ್ಕಂತಹ ಪ್ರಿಫರೆನ್ಸ್ ಶೇರ್ ಹೋಲ್ಡರ್ಸ್ಗೆ ಬಾನು ರೇಖಾ ಲಿಮಿಟೆಡ್ ಕಂಪನಿಯವರು ಏನೇನು ಕೊಡ್ತಾ ಇದ್ದಾರೆ ಅನ್ನೋದನ್ನ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ತೋರಿಸ್ಬೇಕು ಜಸ್ಟ್ ನೌ ವಿ ಸಾ ದ ಪೇಮೆಂಟ್ ಮೇಡ್ ಟು ಈಕ್ವಿಟಿ ಶೇರ್ ಹೋಲ್ಡರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಆನಂದ್ ಲಿಮಿಟೆಡ್ ನೌ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ರೈಟ್ ಡೌನ್ ವಾಟ್ ಆರ್ ದಿ ಪೇಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಮೇಡ್ ಟು ಪ್ರಿಫರೆನ್ಸ್ ಶೇರ್ ಹೋಲ್ಡರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಆನಂದ್ ಲಿಮಿಟೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಬಾನು ರೇಖಾ ಲಿಮಿಟೆಡ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ವಾಟ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಇಶ್ಯೂಯಿಂಗ್ ಬಾನು ರೇಖಾ ಲಿಮಿಟೆಡ್ ಇಸ್ ಇಶ್ಯೂಯಿಂಗ್ ಈಕ್ವಿಟಿ ಶೇರ್ಸ್ how many equity shares 30000 equity shares of rupees 10 each but issued at a premium of 12 which is 3 lakh 60000 second they are giving 8% preference shares how many preference shares they are giving they are giving 20000 preference shares of rupees 10 each which is nothing but 2 lakh so now we need to add all these things 6 lakh plus 3 lakh plus 2 lakh plus 3 lakh 60000 plus 2 lakh when you add all these things you will get 16 lakh 60000 this is nothing but the purchase consideration so 16 lakh 60000 is the purchase consideration so in this problem we have seen how to calculate purchase consideration by using pay net payment method when we will use when we will use net payment method when in the question itself they have given the mode of discharge of purchase consideration so e problem alli na ven nodidvi purchase consideration na net payment mulaka hege kandidiyodu anadru mulaka e problem alli nodidivi hope you people understood how to solve purchase consideration by using net payment method the question and the notes of this particular problem i have put in the first comment kindly you can download the link of the question as well as notes thank you if you have any queries regarding today's session 
kindly send your queries to education.mbbroadcast at gmail.com.